What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of the TCG Card Shop Simulator. Today is episode 12. What an insane, insane suggestion. We are 12 episodes deep already. Last few episodes have been crazy, we've been expanding the shop, we've been building stuff up. We are now looking to save up to try and get lot B so that we can move the tables in there and turn the shop room into more of a shop room and then have a room just for playing completely separately. That's the plan. I've also seen that the developer has said the next update he pushes will hopefully bring in the ability for the NPCs to trade cards with the store. I'm very much looking forward to that update. So let's make sure that we um have got plenty of money to buy some of them really cool cards when they eventually come through. Enough waffling. Let's get into it. Here we are back on the morning of day 31. Would you go to our price checks? Because I don't think we did that at the end of the last episode. We definitely didn't because we've got cards waiting to go out here. Market 10 turn. Market 10 turn. Market 10 turn. Market 10 turn. Market. Oh, we've already done that one. Wait. Uh, Lovely stuff. Right. Left to right, top to bottom. Let's do this. 29. If we do any better, we can. We're going to go 29 50. Four pound flat. We're absolutely trying it. 12.75. It's quite hard stuck there. 17 14 50 17 50 325 We're gonna try a lot for that one. 70 pounds, lovely stuff. We'll already check the price on them. We'll leave that at 35 flat. 17.75. Oh, that's a big price drop, Christ. 47.50. We might finally change our uh, table rules today, chat, as well. We'll see. 650 we'll call it. I'm not happy about it though. We'll already check them, we'll already check them, we'll already check them. 2050. 1050. 1625. 28 still. 20. 21. Sorry, I'm very uncomfortable. I can't work out why. Sorry, annoying. Um, and some board games. Um, 41 dead on. What about you? 46 still. Awesome. Well, let's get it. Let's get the store open and make some money. That's the other thing we need to work out how to buy. Idea, why is it under? Yeah, we've got the auto scent one there. We're almost leveled up enough for this one, so I might just wait for this one. They're 1500 each, but they're not cheap. Fair price for a D20 white, so you're damn right it is. None of my cards are expensive, you lying wench. 41, 36. Uh, yeah, good comms. Boom, 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 boom. My. That's better. 
Um, lovely stuff. Seventeen fifty. Oh my goodness! Two deck boxes and all. Hundred two pound exact change. Oh my goodness! Big rollers this morning. One fifty six. Oh nine. Jesus Christ! Uh, all the fail bills probably get. Yeah, so to get the next four expansions here in like 25, uh, it's like four-ish grand. Whereas to just buy the lot next door, which is inherently more space, is, um, what was it? It was just like five grand flat? Yeah. So if we could try and get up to like nine grand, we'll be able to buy in there and look at all that space, all that real estate, as well as move that back a whole nother wedge. And then we'll have a lot more room for products. Oh my goodness. We're going to be spending a lot of money on stock today, I feel like. What do we think? £295 order, by the way. Christ alive. What a strange, peculiar, weird time. Are we? Lecture books be flying. Everything be flying. I feel like I sold loads of everything already today. Yeah, look, we've got like no fucking booster boxes left. I don't even know what stock we've got left here. Boom, boom. I need to have two of them in all fairness. Oh my god. Like first shift back off in the holiday, I don't know what's going on. That's all I'm that's fine. Lots of people playing the game as well. Um, twenty. Oh. Um, all my stuff. I wanna, I wanna look at my. Oh my god, we're out of boxes. Oh. Um, I want to look at. Wow. Um. Oh. Look how pretty. 777 that's worth. We'll be able to put oh, oh we we could get so much for that. <laughs> Once the um lunchtime rush dies down, we'll start working out what stock we need to order tonight. goodness i'm telling you we're getting like rewarded for expanding up how much different stock we offer by the way it's the only thing that makes sense yeah right that's a very normal thing to do to buy five of the exact same comic right we need one of you
we need one of you. We need cleanser. We I'm gonna order some sleeves as well. Yes, more. Collection book, I think we're okay for now. We've got a lot of dice. Yellow deck boxes are probably a good idea. Other than that, I actually think we're okay. It just feels like we... I mean, we have sold a lot of stuff. We, like, have such a good amount of stock that we carry. That it's actually not too much of an issue. I reckon these six just go straight in there. That's what I'm trying to work out. Because if they do, we can get so much shelving and stuff in here to really reorganize how stuff is. Because like, what I'd love to do is have a double shelf width of packs, boxes, sleeve. And then the next level up sleeve, these packs, boxes. Then the next level up sleeve these pack boxes. Then do you know what I mean? Oh my goodness. Where's he gone? No. What are we doing? Uh, oh Christ, we're almost out of cards on the table there. S 74 quid like that. I swear, it didn't even look like he was buying anything. I think we're in um, shop mode, which is nice. No, oh, sorry, not shop mode, game mode. Which should give me a bit more room here. What have we still got down here on the shelf? Boom. Surprised it didn't let me undercharge it, man. Interesting. What are we saying? Are we missed out on any stock realistically? Definitely need cleanser, that's fine. Red box. Wait, which ones have we got down here? That's that kind, isn't it? Yeah. I've even done that. Oh, 
Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> we think staff might be worth it. Hundred and fifty a day, that's as much as our bills. And he's slow to restock, but he's normal at the checkout. I just don't think he's worth it. But yeah, look, this guy's slow checkout. This guy's normal checkout, whatever the fuck that is. the guard did buy the card do the roar another way to increase money is definitely going to be um management we can definitely Look at that, it costs 200 a day, but it's 15 an hour. I think we'll do that. I think we don't get a member of staff until we've got the next like layer of this unlocked and they're done. And at that point, I think it will then be worth it. Okay, cool. Let me put my um, stock order in. I need four hundred pounds on stock for what seemingly restock. Obviously, I didn't update it again, so I might notice I need some other bits. But I would say overall, that is not too bad. Um, eight packs are for me. How many does that leave us with? None. Box empty. Phenomenal. That worked out beautifully. Then you go on there. Boom. And um, what's that? This one's almost empty, so I'll start selling this one. And I want this on the top shelf just so it's easier to get to. Oh, I now need to buy that board game that I wasn't going to buy because I'm sold out. And uh, tabletop. Get which one is it? Number one. Yeah. <laughs> There's one left in there. Are you All right, well, I guess I'll stay there for now. Let's open up these packs before we end the day, then. Right, cool. Now, we've changed it, so we want first edition cards. They are going to sell better. Ooh, £8. That's cool. Ooh, that's really cool. Fucking 50 quid pack first up. That's first edition, so that's the kind of card that might go up in price now. Another one.
479. Pull up, baby! Let's go! Oh my god! A full art followed by a silver edition foil worth 26. Oh my goodness. And multiple first editions in there. What a pack. Five ninety five, let's go. Four ninety we we pulled some monster cards in here. Lots of new cards as well. Ooh. EX seventeen seventy five. Really fun. 139, 837. So much fun. All of them dupes. Right. Put some new cards out. But, but how much do we make today? Profit of 1300 on the day. And our game earnings about to go nuts, by the way, because we're like doubling that. Like that game earning might legitimately double tomorrow. Right, we'll do a quick price check and then we'll get the store open and see how much money we can make today. Hint, it should be a lot. Right, yeah. Three pound. I've got to be honest. I like that the price is active i do i would like it if it wasn't so every day that makes sense or if you just give us like a screen where i can go and change prices quickly instead of having to manually go to everything uh, 1275 especially when a lot of the prices do kind of the way I'm doing it need to stay the same go on get back about 30 there we go we're gonna we're gonna push for 30 50 because we sold out of you yesterday 320 wait is that yeah six you know what we can have one more day where it's a little bit low Oh my god, these take a massive jump. Let's go. I want to see some of them bad boys move today. 16, 25. 35, 25. Not 25, 25. 35, 25. Christ. Already checked them. Oh, they dropped a bit. These are really volatile. But they're worth so much money that it's fine. It's like, am I going to make a fuck ton of money or just a lot of money? Mm -hmm. 27.75. Dice are quite volatile as well, but like... Not bad. They just bounce up and down a lot. Same as the deck boxes. Some stuff has like really tight ranges and some stuff just like doesn't really move. Like these things just do not really move at all. Awesome. card 
One. Seventy three change. Oh, that's power of bells. Um, has the game changed? Yes, it has. Cool. When does this, when do we unlock the next one? Not far away from unlocking the next one. I imagine Silver Legacy will be Silver Edition cards will go up in value. So I think we want to get our next shop expansion today, or this episode rather. And then next episode, we want to go and get some new licenses. Like some, look at some of these licenses. We've not got any epic card boxes. We're almost going to be able to afford legendary. But I want to, I want to start unlocking some stuff. Um, five, nine, fifty. Cool. Goodbye. Let's go. Oh my god, there's a stinky dude. I didn't even see him. You're coming to my shop dwelling like that! This dude's just spent a uh, pretty penny. Have a good day, sir. You too, sir. And you, sir. I'm liking that I'm still seeing a similar amount of people playing at the tables, despite the fact that the game is now worth twice as much per hour. I know it also increased our costs, but worth it. Yeah, look at that. 38 from them dudes each. Well, that's the goal. D20 black dice is not expensive, you bitch. We are flying around. Oh, we saw one of these things again. Let's go. There we go. Five G's in the bank. Five G's in the bank, in the bank. Like the average sale price has gone up so much, it's insane. Just imagine how much stock we're going to be able to get if we can have more shelves along here as well. It's going to give so much more room. Room for activities. And by activities, I mean selling things.
it's so insane that when people get up from playing now, I literally like spot the price jump in the bank balance. It's not like the game didn't make a lot of money before, but it kind of. Oh, man, you're the checkout 1,000 customers. Whoop, whoop. That's an achievement, baby. You sell well, 1,000th customer. Um. Yeah, before the money just kind of snuck in with the other transactions, but I literally like spot it jump up now, which is hilarious. 101.11. Like, yeah, 43. Like, that's a hundred pound nearest damage just from them two. And now they're going to spend some more on cards. Yeah, like, adds up. 83 from these two so far. They're going to spend another five pound there. 86, actually. I'm done. So far, plus another five is now going to be what? 90. Yeah, these people with the nearest down spent 100 quid in the store today. Heroes. Oh my god. I think it might be time to... Oh, actually, one sec. What else we got still chilling on here? Get a few more of them out. No, we sold some sleeves today. Oh, I've just walked past two smelly farts. Whoosh. I really wish the um, grabbing was better. And then... So what do we want? What do we need? More play mats, more dice. Red dice, white dice, blue dice. We need all the dice, play mats, and that's basically it. As it stands. Oh, comics as well. Accessories. Dice. Flame out. Comic. We're looking at a thousand pound in stock needed currently. So we still need to make a bit more money today for it to be viable. There's something there, James, but it's the kind of game that where people will have the most fun just having their own store they can be in charge of. Bro, instead of lurking and watching other people play, why don't you sit down and play yourself? A couple of packs for the lady. Boom. Boom. Holy Right, well, someone wants to rip some packs. Mm -hmm. 
Poin, 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 poin. Come on, we need to make like another two hundred quid here. Need to try and save every penny at the minute, Colin. We're trying to get the expansion into the B lot. And we need to spend a thousand pounds on stock as well as buying the B lot. Get heard. I'll turn the lights on a half seven as I normally do. Oh, we need to get the cards out, Christ. Dice for you, seven. Um, yesterday we did about 1700 in turnover because we made about 1300 and we spent about 500. So I think we're around 17, 1800. One, two, three. Oh, stinky fucks. Do you? Oh no, it's the person out. I thought there was two, but they just lined up and my eyes got confused. Okay, oh wait, we got some more of them up there, so that's actually, we probably could get away with not buying them. stock order in now. You got rid of tables and stopped selling individual cards and you're making seven to eight K a day. But the tables are like free money. Did did you just want all the space for the stock or or what? But I struggle to see the um the benefit of stopping or Table play. Tables are just like basically my profit margin. And they can, I mean, I guess they're worth a lot less if you're not using them to min max hard selling. They reduce the speed of custom turn around now. How many have I got left up there? Five. I don't think there's anywhere else I can stuff them in, so you can go there for now. I've literally mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Righto, so what we'll do is we will finish the day today so we can see our turnover and then we'll buy the store for the next room. So yeah, our, our revenue today was 21. Operating cost was about 14, 20, so we made about 700 pounds in profit. But this was a particularly expensive supply. So we'll do this. We'll go my DIY. No, Renault. We're going to buy the lot B first. And then we're going to what gets you fuckers it stacked in here the best. We're going to have a little play around with these. Can I go three lengthways? How much room we're gonna have for activities? Oh my god, don't quite fit that way. Son of a bitch. Okay, so um if I do that instead. How many am I gonna fit in here? Got stuck on something. Yeah, all, all six level going in there out of the way. Fucking mint. Right, so why are you complaining? Being a weirdo. Nice. Oh my god, look how much room we have. Are you actually joking? I'm being trolled, aren't I? There's no fucking way. Right, well that works. And then one right in there. There we go, we've got this room maxed out for tables for now. Look how much bigger this fucking room is. I can finally just get this for now out of my fucking way so I don't trip on it all the time. Okay, this is better. And then I'm going to move this ironically right in my way. But so it's closer. Oh, much better. Right, let's do a price check. None of these prices have gone up for me. Don't go down. Ah, he's dead saying, good boy. Uh, oh my god, this price come crushing down on me. No, that wasn't right. These things were 70 quid two days ago. Yeah, 36... 75, lovely. 16, 25, also lovely. 45, these have just crashed. 6, 60. 3, 20. 4 pound exactly still, love that. I'll we'll check what there. 20, 50, 10, 50. I'm a little bit low on them. I probably should have ordered some. Oh well. What have I just done there? 15, 75 is what I want. 27. Already checked the price on them, so that's fine. 40 it is. Don't crash as well. Awesome. 
Now that we've got the other room where all the card gaming can take place, we're going to have the room now to just put shelves on shelves on shelves on shelves in here so that we can stock as many different items as possible. And now when I see a smelly boy, I can just go bang right there. Oh my goodness, big spender first thing in the morning. What time to be alive? Um... <laughs> Sorry, guys, you need to harass more of my customers. Yeah, I didn't pay the bill yet because I wanted to make sure I definitely had enough before I tried to. What are we up to now? Still 142. I'm going to assume then the first day is acted as free for that second lot because the price hasn't jumped. Why is no one in here? Yep, that's open. No one's playing games. Should I be concerned? My misunderstanding. Is that room not supposed to be used for that? Oh my good gravy. Okay, someone's gone in there now. It must have just been the time of the morning. Yeah, you can go there. Like this can just kind of go. And now, right there. And they can just kind of get thrown in there. Why can you just clear me out, cleanser, you absolute bag? They're the exact same card, buddy boy. Mind if I charge 850? Okay, people are playing in there now. Good. Oh. See how much more fucking peaceful it is now. I say that. I feel like customers are coming thicker and faster now. So Colin, maybe that's the trick you need to uh, stop your not get your customers slowed down. In all fairness, the the tables do see less usage earlier on in the day. Anyway, I think I just poked my head in at a moment where it was empty, and panic like I'd broken everything.
No, I could just grab one before I reset the price, because if he did, fair fox. Maybe. I'm probably losing money on them cards. I might start ripping packs, put 10 most expensive cards out in the morning, and then just leave it until it's, like, empty. Just because I'm, I, I get really stressed out putting cards during the day. We're up to a thousand pound on the day, by the way. Which, bearing in mind how much we spent, is really, really fun. I feel like today's gonna be a decently expensive stock day, though. I've got to be honest. The speed customers seem to be coming in today without me really changing anything. If I notice a big uptick in the amount of customers we served, it might be time to get an employee. Yeah, if the amount of customers is increasing significantly, we may have to um, have some thoughts. Right. Goodness. Um, 72, 60. I spotted you, motherfucker. See, that's my main concern about not being able to see there. Right. Stock. Um, we're going to do a box of eight. One of them. One of them. One of them. Don't need any of them. Right. Accessories. One of them that we're okay for. Deck boxes. Don't know what shit I've got over here at the minute, which is a little bit stressful. Oh, this is my empty box transport and stuff. Okay, cool. Okay, no matter what, I can now get this fucking thing out. So that's start. Right, blue deck boxes. Fuck, I'm an idiot. Bought a license. Why? Yeah, that's fine. Collector's books. We'll buy some collector's books. Other than that, we are all good. Um, I legit might, once we expand these slots out, just turn the bit behind this into a bunch of racking, just to store stuff. There's nothing there, you dumb motherfucker. Um, it'd be nice for there to be a secondary collection, but it is what it is. Uh, 
How much are we looking to spend on stock at the minute? 600? Fucking min. Um... Spender. It's not even what I meant today, so. Twenty-three. I need to watch time better with no one in here now, though, because I will just not keep an eye on it. But oh, why are there no customers? I need to get them smelling machines installed. They cost so much. I need so many of them. Like, what was it? That one's 500, which isn't too bad, but why is this one better? Holds up to four cleansers. There's just only two of them. I don't know. I just go do the first quick place. Sorry, if I go total value, no, if I go amount, yeah, I've got 67 of them fucking things. I need to get like that table that lets you bundle them together. Oh, have a good day, sir. All right, let's order a stop. Oh, okay. So the more expensive ones are more efficient. Well, there might. Well, I just don't accidentally put through the one loser. Um, two of these are going to be mine. We're opening some cards. Ones are. Mm. Yeah, I'll do it in a second. There, mine. We opening some packs, ladies and gentlemen. 
We're not opening in 18 of these. We'll open eight. One. Oh, you got an extra penny change. Congratulations, sir. Right, first up. Ooh, 639. That's fun. How's a customer just walked in? They must have come in from next door, mustn't they? I can go there. I want to take P out of here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That way I don't get carried away. 29. Right. Well, upgrading impacts. Or not. Christ, these cards are shit. Come on, there's got to be something good for me in here. Or not. These packs are proper poo. And now we're getting some cards. Not exactly a phenomenal pack though, is it? Hmm, better. Right, epic packs. There we go, 540 off for it. 392. Now these are what I'm talking about. These are some packs. Come on. These are these are very very good packs. <laughs> no. Nothing that interesting there. Decent pack, decent pack. Right. Show me something good. That does count as something good. Not bad. Oh, hello. <laughs> Helio. 19 pound. The rare packs are a bit of a scam, aren't they? Oh, gold edition foil, 71 pound. I want my first, like, not insane one. Decent pack. But again, just not, not that impressive, is it? Right, last eight. Last eight. I mean, it's profitable pack, but that was a card worth seven pence. Oh, that's a cool card. Mm. 
Again, it's profitable, but it's nothing that's blowing me away here. Thousand, James. I want something in the thousands. Come on. No, he's got me excited, but it was not worth it. Oh. Right. That's us out of packs. Let's end the day, I guess. We lost £3,826 today. But once you take out the cost of the upgrade, we were up 1400 which is phenomenal. Revenue of 2400 is is good. This is a good day. Very, very good. And there you have it, folks. That was episode 12 of the TCG Card Shop Simulator. We finally got them playing tables out of the, my field of view. They're tucked away in a corner out of the way. We've got a lot more space to get some more shelves up so that we can stock more products and more of products we want to stock. So that's really good. Next episode is all going to be about trying to just expand everything out a little bit more, create a bit more space for ourselves, create a bit more money for ourselves so that we can really consider going ham opening packs to try and pull some nuts cards. It's been a blast as always. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.